It punches you. It punches in the mouth. It's a mouth punch. It is a mouth punch. I'm getting punched in the mouth by this cookie. It's a cookie. <laughs> We are. It's time to celebrate the holidays. Oh, I love making cookies for Christmas. There is nothing better than sharing a plate of cookies with your neighbors. My mom did My that. My mom did that. Oh. Do you remember having like the day where you would bake with your mom and you would bake all the different kinds of cookies? Yes. And you had so much fun because you could decorate them what and do you all these things. We made sugar cookies. We made Russian tea cakes, Ooh, which are super fancy. yummy. We made divinity. <gasps> Fudge, obviously, yeah. all three kinds. Yeah. Chocolate, peanut butter, and vanilla because, mm -hmm. you know, I can't have chocolate. This is another weird thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know what we mm -hmm. made are the sandies that are shaped like little moons. <gasps> the moon sandies. I never, we I never made those. I love those I love those too. Sandies. And, and this cookie that we're about to bake may be... We like, don't even have a name. It doesn't It doesn't. Have you a guys, name. This, is, this is in Helen Corbett. Um, yeah, it's and it's in, cookie. It's a cookie, y'all. It's in the Helen Corbett's cookbook right. from 1954, the one that is literally this is Stephanie's grandmother's. Apart. Let me read you what Helen Corbett has to say. <clears throat> Everyone who has lived in Texas a long time has heard of Miss Fanny Andrews. Pause. I <laughs> Miss searched, Fanny Andrews. I searched Google high and low. The only thing I found about anybody named Fanny Andrews in Texas, yeah. one, there is an elementary school in Austin named after Fanny Andrews, but there's nothing about her that said she was a cook or what. And then there is also a post-Civil War Fanny Andrews in Georgia. That's not our Fanny. Who uh, was a, she wrote botany <laughs> books and also novels, but she's in Georgia and... She was post Civil Wars, and this is this is mid century, mid you know this is Helen Corbett's 1954. Okay, so this is not our Fanny. So if you guys know who Fanny Andrews is in Texas, please tell us. So anyway, so Helen Corbett says if you've lived in Texas, um, you've long heard of Miss Fanny Andrews, and if they haven't, they should. Well, so you should. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. Helen. Um, this is her recipe for a Christmas cookie, spelled C O O K Y. Ooh, a cookie. This is a Christmas cookie, so we can call it a Christmas cookie, We're right? We can call it a Christmas cookie. 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 That is most delicious in her language and divine in mine. So let me tell you how to make the <laughs> okay, how are Fanny making... Andrews Christmas cookie. Cookie. Uh, you are going to empty a pound box of brown sugar into a bowl. There it is. Uh, you are going to drop in three eggs and beat well. Okay. Eggs, beat well. You're going to add it. two cups of flour. Okay, flour. One cup of chopped, okay. unpeeled orange slices. We're going to slice this orange. We're not going to peel it. We're going to chop it. Okay. We're going to add it to our mixture. I, I've read this so many times. Too. We're chopping this orange mm -hmm. into slices, and then we're chopping them up yeah. into pieces that go into the Christmas cookie. Yeah. That's all it says. Then, and okay. we're, oh, but first you're going to dredge them in flour a little bit okay, so that so I guess they don't stick together. Right, okay, okay. Uh, you're going to add a cup of chocolate pecans. You're going to bake it in shallow pans lined with wax paper and buttered at 350 until done. Then you're going to ice while it's hot with a very thin icing of orange juice, powdered sugar, and, and some orange peel. So we'll probably right. just juice we'll one just of these juice bad this days. up. And... and then when it's dry, cut into small squares and take it to your neighbors Let's make up. a christmas kooky because it's kooky <laughs> merry christmas kookies. kookies okay so i am to put three eggs in with this and beat them up yep beat them up okay that's all you gotta do and then i'm just slicing up this these orange slices and this peel that's so bizarre all right so you ready? Yeah, that's a thick batter. It is a very thick batter. Um, you know what I feel like would go well in this? What? Some of those um, candied fruits. From oh, the, candied fruits. Maybe this is what is... they only sell at Christmas time? Yeah. I thought you were going to say rum. 
rum oh, would go. I was thinking that too. <laughs> okay, well, I, I think it's incorporated though, and okay, I I'm think gonna prepare a pan and then let some it's time to cook this it. bad boy. The kooky. Oh, this, it just says bake until done. It doesn't tell you what right. consistency. It doesn't tell you should it be a cake-like texture? Should it be a crispy, like does it want a, a crispy it, cookie? Do, we it don't know. Di it didn't So we us. baked it until it was golden brown. And it did. And then we put the, the, the glaze on it. Yeah. Okay, so they're, they're a cake. It's a cakey texture. It's like a cakey Cakey texture, yeah. So yeah, I but and it's, it's done. Is it? Yeah. It's kind of mushy right there. But that's what it is. It's a cake. Okay. I think. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Are they done? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's very brown sugary. It's got that brown sugar quality. It's very orangey. You don't like it. I can tell from your face. I just got a lot of orange. Well, because it had a whole a orange. I mean, let me see. Oh, yeah. I got a bite. Oh, yeah. Kind of offensive when oh, you. Oh, yeah. yeah. There uh -huh. it is. Yeah. Yeah, I'm eating orange rind. I'm eating orange rind right now. Right? Mm-hmm. That was an odd choice, Fanny Andrews. Maybe it should be small. Maybe you should just put that sh candied citron in here instead of a dang orange. Like, whoa. Get my vitamin C. Oh. I mean, it's it's orange. Oh, my. Oh. It is. Oh. <laughs> oh. I, I'm, I'm getting punished by an orange peel. And it's sugary, like it's a, it's well, um. Because of that icing, I wouldn't give this to my neighbors. Well, not with that orange. Not with that much. Peel. I would make this again with that citron because really it was easy to make. Uh huh. It was just like, how many ingredients? It tastes good, except for there are just big chunks of orange peel. What if you did it with uh, with zest? Zested it, okay. Use the zest. Okay. Um, but would you still include like the orange, the the meat? Because I think she wants you to have like an orange experience and zest may oh, not be enough. There's an experience happening. <laughs> that's for sure. So next time, don't put an orange rind full on no. in your cookie. No. Fanny Andrews. Miss Fanny Andrews. Texas. Of Texas. Tell us what's happening. What's going on with these cookies? Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas. Thanks for watching. Happy holidays. All the things. All the things. Make these. Tell us what your Make Christmas cookies are. Make them differently. Yeah, tell, tell us, us what, what your, your Christmas, Christmas cookies are. We what's your go-to? Yeah. Maybe we should make that.